You know, Halloween is coming up. I should probably do something in costume. And because it's Halloween, I think I'm going to strip something appropriate. Namely, Darksiders 2 Collector's Edition. Possibly THQ's only remaining saving grace. Possibly. And yes, I am aware of how ironic that is. So, let's get to it, shall we? Uh, much like their Saints Row, it comes in this little half uh, reveal thing. And you can see what the uh, kind of the gimmick here is. Uh, Death said mask. But, don't worry, there's more in there, so... If the box seems... a little worn, well, I don't know why that is, really, but... Uh, almost... There we go! So, first thing up to bat is the game itself. And this, and I got the Best Buy ex, uh, exclusive here. So, yeah. No voices in my head sending me shit this time. There you go. Right away you can tell this is interesting because it's got like a 3D cover on it. 3D hollow gloss thing. So that's cool. And here we have the game. Fortunately don't need to unwrap it anymore. Uh, so you can see up here in the corner it says Free, includes access to free DLC, Argus' Tomb. And here, we have the Darksiders comic. Kind of a mini comic, uh, published by Dark Horse. And, yeah. Cool, huh? And let's see what else we have in here. Ah, it's the D, it's the download code for the Angel of Death pack. Uh, let me, let me read this here. Give yourself an edge with a unique set of enhanced armor with a heavenly design, as well as a pair of upgrading, upgraded matching sights and new color VFX trail from your trusty crow dust. Uh, promotion code valid 81412 through 111912. Ooh, so I better uh, redeem that fast. And here we have uh, an advertisement for Metro, Last Light, and South Park, The Stick of Truth. Pre-order now and get the Good Times with Weapons content pack, including the Bullrog Chicken Attack, Cartman's Kick-Ass Psy, and a Samurai costume. Ooh. And let's see here. And this is basically the same thing, uh, except it's for Argul's Tomb. Hmm. It's a whole new dungeon to explore. All right, well, I'll take that. Um, let's see here. And last 
but not least, we have the gate annual itself, a very abrupt one. Oh, hold on, there's something else here. Your Crucible Passcode. Uh, da da da. Doesn't exactly say what it is. But, uh. Doesn't look like there's any, uh. Expiration date, so. Huh. Guess I'll have to check that out. So. Uh, there we have it. That was what was inside the uh, actual game box. So let me just uh, replace all this stuff here. Apparently this, the comic is not, oh well. Yeah, that'll work. Let's see what else we have in here. Uh, the Shadow of Death Pack. Strike fear to the hearts of your enemies with the otherworldly Shadow of Death armor and sight set. So yeah, a lot of DLC to go going on here. And let's see. Ah, the digital soundtrack. Now I think I like the giving uh, digital soundtracks better than actual CDs because you know it saves room and after you use it you can throw it out. And let's see here, last, at least in here, is, ooh, an artwork chronicle. So, let's see here, ooh. Ain't that a beaut? So I like how the compact size of this. Oh, and in case you couldn't tell, there's a, I guess this is the logo of death. I don't know if you can actually see that. It's real long, but. <clears throat> and now, the death's head mask. Kidding. So, and here we have a stand for it. So, uh, I guess we'll, oh, hello. Um, all right, let's see here. Um, no, I guess this goes, yep. Okay, and uh, let's see here. Hmm. Oh, I think I nope. There we go. So.
So what do you think? Pretty scary, huh? Well, I can't wait to redeem all this DLC, download the soundtrack, and just having a good time being death. Wait, that's a Freudian slip. Uh, good time playing death. No, that's another Freudian slip. Well, good time playing the game. So, until next time, I'll see you on the next strip search.